While the Cowboys of the 19th century favored the Winchester repeating rifle, their counterparts in the United States Army were using trapdoor Springfields. Hi, I'm Larry Potterfield with Midway USA, and I've got an 1884 model trapdoor Springfield saddle ring carbine made it to Springfield Armory, Springfield, Massachusetts. Let me show you a few things about it. You can see we've got a very generous hammer, a three-click tumbler, safety, load, and fire. Now the trigger is serrated and checkered on the tip, straight grip stock all the way back to the carbine-style steel butt plate, and we've got a trap in the butt plate to hold a cleaning rod. 22-inch round barrel. This is called the Buffington-style rear sight. It's graduated all the way out to 1,900 yards. And you can see that we've got a steel hood around the front sight to protect it from damage. Now they made trapdoor Springfields from 1866 to 1892. Total production around 700,000 of rifles and carbines. This particular gun was made in 1886. It's got a serial number in the 343,000 range. Let me show you a couple of other neat features. First of all, this is the saddle ring. This is how it gets the name saddle ring carbine. A cavalry trooper wore a harness that clipped right on here so he didn't lose his gun in combat. Here's how the trapdoor Springfield got its name. This is the trapdoor. Actually, it's a breech bolt. It houses the firing pin and actuates the extractor. I've got some 4570 snap caps here. By the way, how fast do you think you could load and fire a trapdoor Springfield? Well, the Army tested just that in 1873, about 20 rounds a minute. So there you have it, the trapdoor Springfield saddle ring carbine. I'm Larry Potterfield with Midway USA. That's the way it is.